Welcome to the lounge, all my fellow loungers, chillers, ballers, and grillers. Hey, I wanted to turn the camera on because Joe came over and the first words out of his mouth were, I want to apologize. So I'm like, and let me get the camera. Super awkward. Yeah, because. You seem awfully comfortable we, though. We did ha huh? Oh, I'm sorry. Yours is over there, dude. No. Oh, yeah, I, I was watching a Phillies game the other day. Oh, that'd be perfect. Oh, yeah. This, this is my favorite kind of yeah, weather. Yeah, yeah. Now that springtime is not quite like. 100% humidity yet. Yeah. It's nice breezy. So guys, since, you know, the last time you guys seen, yeah, I know, right? I had to look at it. Like, who's coming at me, dude? But uh, since the last guys you saw that with me and Joe is that we had a, a little altercation <laughs> outside and I read the comments and everybody was like, So I wanted to talk upset. to you about it uh, during the podcast, but unfortunately, JT, Jesse were here. I had soccer before the podcast. So by the time I got here, it was a full house already. Yeah. Um, and they stuck around forever afterwards. They did. They didn't leave. Usually they take off pretty fast. Yeah, they're out of there right away. Well, J uh, JT's defense, he was out of there right away. Yeah, he was. He was out five minutes before they were done. Nah, they were hanging out. We haven't yeah. seen. Oh, yeah, yeah, we, we haven't hung out with them two in a while. I, mean, I get it, but yeah. And uh, we could just talk. And I feel like that we left it kind of on bad terms. Well, I, not bad terms. It's. It's. You know what I mean. I. I. So I reflected on the situation. I felt like I overstepped my bounds. Um, I, I feel like that I, as a parent and as a friend, I should never have came here and question that at all. Um, unfortunately, when I stopped by, I wasn't expecting you guys to be out front together. No, I was hoping to catch that's, you. That was part of the deal. Is like I just had, you know, Tom comes out and he starts talking about the mowing the lawn and stuff like. While that. you and were then, mowing the lawn, which made yeah, it even worse because you're. It's yeah, so I was out. already irritated, and it hurts. was hot. It was hot. Yeah. Um, and plus, I'm known for you know, my great timing. You know, I also read the, I read the comments, guys. I mean, you might not think that I do, but I do read the comments, and um, I'm not going to respond to most of them. <laughs> but because um, people were saying you use a push mower, I've always used a push mower. I don't like doing a riding lawnmower because I like the exercise of walking. And he has a big yard, but he's lots of in the yard, so yeah. a riding lawnmower probably wouldn't save him. No, I could do it faster with a push lawnmower. Just except right now, my knee. It'd be beneficial now. Yeah. So I mean. My knee was bothering me. I worked all day. I came I, home. I thought the lawn was going to be mowed, so I went out there and mowed it, and I was not in a good mood to begin with before you even came over. Right, no, yeah. So I think it was it was definitely a combination of mm -hmm. a few different things, but it, while, watching back the video, um, which I had no intention on, it was awkward for me to watch it, but I was also reading through the comments, and uh, you know, I had no right to come over here and tell you how to parent your kid, even though he's, a, he's 23 and, or how is he? He's 23, yeah. See? He's 23. I've known him forever. I care about him as well. It doesn't, it doesn't change the fact that you're my boy. You're his dad. That's your... I should never come over. Unless I see something that's, you know, grossly negligent or you're doing something that's completely horrible. Right. I shouldn't ever even bring it right, up. Right. So and you, I, un you understood my point of view? Yeah. No, I get it. I, 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 I've, I've gotten your point of view from the get-go. I just felt like maybe you could use a little bit more perspective on how you were handling the situation. And, and I think that I was wrong by doing that, but I, I didn't necessarily disagree with anything that you were doing. I just felt like the way that you did it, even though you were trying to do the right things, like getting him to come out and do yard work with you. Yeah, no, and usually I'm open to you, you are. Know, when you it was just something. It, it was just that you hit me at a bad time. So I think it was a, it was a conversation. I've had awkward conversations with you in the past about you know, certain situations in our life, and you've had them with me, and we've right. both been open about it and, and taking the criticism. But in certain situations, it becomes way harder. Right. And I should have known right away. But I kind of almost felt like I was there, and then I already said we wanted to talk about something, even though I, I knew at that point, there's a point in the conversation where I'm like, oh, well, I shouldn't be saying this right now. But yeah. it was too late. I, I, what yeah. am I going to do at that point? I couldn't think of anything else yeah. to say. Well, then you peel tires, and so it was like... <laughs> that was a complete accident. My gas pedal sticks. Right. Yeah, I know how to That's fix that. That's what you said, yeah. Huh? Do I not? Yeah, WD-40. WD-40. Yeah, spray a little bit on there. Is it like a cable underneath? I don't even look it down there. It's probably just your pedal itself, where there's a spring underneath there. Yeah, it just sticks when I there. first hit it, but yeah, and you have a lot of rocks in your driveway. Yeah, yeah, no kidding, because they were all over the place. Yeah. They weren't, no, there was probably one little tiny spot. There's, there's a probably, hole. You, you, uh, you one hole, right? There's yeah. one tire spun. You're as bad as the male person. That's what the male person does <laughs> when they drop off stuff. They spin tires. They probably have time. a gas pedal that sticks it. You can't control it. Yeah, it's, I didn't, yeah. I, look, in my mind, though, when that happened, I was like, "Man, I really just pissed you off." 
and now I'm, I'm spinning tires out of your driveway. Just, yeah, I was just, like I said, it, I was mad. You probably didn't there. even I notice was, that happening when it happened, but like I feel like I should have said, hey, I'm my bad, I'm sorry, because... At first, I thought you did it on purpose. That's why I wanted to say I'm sorry. Yeah. So you know me, you can tell me at that point. If yeah. I was like, I'm not mad at you, I'm sorry, it was an accident, you know yeah. it was an accident. Well, I'm sorry for for the whole thing, mm -hmm. you know what I mean? Like, that, that, that it got I to that I honestly point. feel like that you, that you weren't in the wrong, I don't, you, you didn't disrespect me, you didn't, you didn't... Over, I don't think you did anything wrong with how you handled me. I think that you were completely in the right, and I and I'm, I, I admit when I'm wrong. I'm all about gaining perspective. I gain perspective on the situation, right. and I feel like that I, I handled it completely wrong. Yeah. But speaking of handling situations, what? Did see the contract? Oh, uh, did you see that? Man, it's pretty smart. It's pretty up on your game. You're up well, on yeah, your game well, I just, right there. Well, I just want to make sure that because I don't want that to happen again, man. Because he had me really worried that if he would have. <laughs> If he would have left, right, we would have had to figure things out because no. he didn't even tell us how to do anything. I agree. I think that's 100% fair and expected that in the situation that he does decide he wants to move on, which is, you're giving him all the right yeah, to do and that. that and I'm like, I just want to have the you want to have a conversation first, exactly, so you can better prepare, so we're yeah. we're not falling on our faces in front of everybody. No, exactly. I get that. And that's all I wanted, like from the beginning, is just if you want to move on, talk to me. Tell Move me, on. Yeah, yeah, and, then, yeah. and then we'll you know we'll figure it out. Well, but don't don't just pull the rug out from under me and. I mean, I'm, I'll be honest with you, I'm glad that he didn't move on, even though, yeah, I, I, I hear that aspect, that's where the main anger, the, the big problem came from, but the oh, fact yeah. that, I mean, thank God, because we've been completely, oh. like, look, I don't need anything more, I mean, I told you I'd be able to handle it, but like, yeah, we're boys, I want to support you, right. and this, because right. we enjoy doing and it, this I, can, I don't need anything this more I can my edit. right now. This I can edit, yeah. and I can do thumbnail for this and everything, and he has taught me some things with thumbnails, well, I did a couple so of thumbnails still... already, so, yeah, yeah I'm that's getting good. better at that, um, will, will I retain it? All the time, not unless you need I to do it more. Yeah, so you need yeah. to do like one a week at least. Um, but I can do this kind, of, but I can't do a lot of the stuff that he does on there. Plus, well, uh, well plus, could you imagine we if we're doing chilling? And, the, we haven't talked about the green screen or any of that kind of or stuff. Or chilling and grilling, like like then I I have to hold the camera. Then hold here, Joe. You hold it, and I'll show the people this. I see, it's impossible for us to do it that time. Yeah, like two, I, I don't think chilling and grilling. I think, I think we've done parts of chilling and grilling with two people. Speaking of that, chilling and grilling is going to come out. Yeah. Soon. So I think we both had a conversation that we feel like it's better now for us to kind of go back to our roots, do some things. Because, not that, I mean, look guys, we're 100% okay right now. Everything's good between us. Yeah. We're, we're, we're great. Yeah. But I feel like having a chilling and growing is going to bring us right back in the, Oh yeah. and it's that time of year. Yeah. Um, but, but before I forget, like the, the other part of the contract though was pretty pretty oh. good about the, uh, the yard work. So it's pretty good. Well, I wanted to put that, <laughs> that's funny because it's like, I wanted to put that in. He doesn't know about that part, right? Yeah. But I wanted well, to put that in because he won't do this stuff right so i want to kind of be able to have a contract to be able to say you know tom you did sign the contract because this is part of the lounge yeah, well, tom, well no you're right it's part of the business no you're I, when he said it, it makes sense and, and he is totally one of those people though it's like you had to give him an end date because he is a very calculated not calculated in a bad way but he looks at everything logistic oh yeah it's yeah. all it's all black and white and people don't understand <clears> that <throat> that every he procrastinates on everything Everything. I, I mean, mean, like, like mowing the lawn. He, he would let it get like this high before he goes out and mow it. I can't stand. No, I couldn't even. Like I, well, ticks. One, my grass is lower. You yeah. have a lot more grass than I do. Yeah, I have a lot of. Well, you can call grass if you want to. That's nice of you. I have areas that, of yours that you have moss over there. I have areas yeah. of that, but you have a lot. Of, I have a lot of moles in my yard. Yeah, I have a lot of moles too. I have a lot of weeds. You know, I think if you get rid of your grubs, you get rid of your moles. How do you get rid of grubs? What are grubs? There's, there's like a bug, weed right? and feed with grub killer. Oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Moles. That gets rid of. I'm not paying my money for that. Uh, no, well, I mean, I, I, I don't even fertilize my. I fertilize my parents, but not mine. Mm -hmm. But I mean, look, it's different if your knee wasn't bad. Like doing your oh, yeah. right now is a lot more, and you're only getting older. No and, offense. You know, I know. I'm, no, I am getting older. I don't take offense to that because I. It's a fact. fact that. Yeah, and that's what you want. But but it's all. In reality, the whole reason I did this is because I want to be able to know, like, just have a conversation with somebody. If something's going to change, I don't want the rug pulled out from under. Yeah, you, you're, you're kind of, you're, you like to prepare for things. Right? Yeah, and, and 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 I think that there's a little bit of, uh, you know, all right, it was it was brash motion. There was a little bit of anger there because there was no heads up. There was a little bit of yeah, other things that are going into it, other than just to. Now you're looking at it from a different perspective that he didn't get it and you right. kind of stand away from the situation and kind of look at it. I feel like you're looking at it more logically now. Um, and you know what I'm talking about? Like It's like when you lived at home. Yeah. Even if you're... Oh, yeah. I still cut my parents' yeah, grass now. I don't know. Excuse me. I don't know what time you moved out of your... I was house. 28. I was a late bloomer. Okay. 
in those years that well, the from the time though. you graduated to <laughs> from you graduated from Same high year. school or or college, uh -huh. right? And you were still living at home. You had to do stuff. You had to you had to do stuff. I still I cut my parents' grass right now every week. Still, I live across I live across street from. Still, I literally I cut their grass right. every single week. I we were talking about fertilizer. I didn't fertilize my yard. I fertilized my parents' right. yard. Just like when it snows, right? I used to go over to my mom's house and have to shovel her out and everything. I'm sure you. Without that, they're 70 years old. And that's what I'm trying to teach. Well, I think it's for time though, and the thing for me too, as as a, as a child, it's hard for me to accept like my parents have limitations. So maybe he part yeah. of it is him accepting the fact that you are getting older. Now your knees going bad. Yeah, I'm starting to get Things limited. Are, right, but maybe for him that's a little bit of a realization that you're getting older and yeah, probably not. But maybe that's part of it. Hey, I saw your car outside. What's up, Joe? What's up, Tom? Hey. Can I What's set up? a hangout? Sure. Nice. Yeah, we're just having doing uh, middle something. Yeah, well, we we, we I wanted to stop by and just yeah. talk to him about the other day, so I wanted to. He wanted to put the camera on. Yeah, figure he why just not. came over to right. apologize for like we're transparent for the way I handled everything. Yeah, and yeah, I yeah, apologize because I kind of I kind of blew off the. We're not off the handle. You know. I think we're about we're about done now. No, we're we're about done. We're going to just end it now anyway. So okay. Could you uh, go behind it and just uh, hit, turn it off? While you're there, dude. Yeah. It's a scam likely calling me. It's a scam likely on my phone. I just got one earlier. I'm tired of that stuff, man. It happens all the time. Well, right, guys. Anyway. So now you see, me and Joe are good. We didn't yeah, hug or kiss and make up. Yeah, well, we high five up. it. Yeah, there you go. Man, I was a, I was that a was solid a high one, five, too. I was going to be pound because <laughs> the high five was so good. But anyway, guys. See, that's what friends do. That's it. You, yeah. you know, everybody, yeah. there's there's moments. You can't agree on everything. And people do things that they shouldn't do. They say that they shouldn't. But you know where I was coming from. I wasn't coming from a, a place of discontent or a place of anger. Or a right. place, I wasn't. I, I was coming from a good place. I just did it the wrong way. I think yeah. that we're friends. Yeah, that, and that's what friends do. That's they have friends disagreements. They have and good times and bad and times. They, and then they're friends again. Yeah, Sometimes we'll, you never want to go the other way and never be. You know what I mean? Like, end friendship. That's just stupid. No, but it happens, unfortunately, all the time. Yeah. Well, guys, till next time, grab yourself some cold drink, put your feet up, relax. We'll meet you at the lounge. <sighs> yeah, that was spot. That was, right? yeah, I get pepper, I nailed it. Cool. That was, yeah, that was, was good. That was pretty hot. I got yeah. to pee. Really grab good. me a little bit. Oh, you know what? Yeah. yeah I'm about ready for one, too. So what's going on, brother? Uh, not much, but... So, uh, what were you guys really talking about? What do you mean? Um, you know, just, like, out here, and I didn't know you were coming over, and... I well, I, 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 well, I was hoping to not stop by and see you guys, so I drove by and saw you guys work in the front yard having a conversation, so I pulled in this time. I just want to apologize. I feel like that... He was outside, he was angry, he was cutting the grass. You know what I mean? Like, I feel like it was a, it's a horrible situation for me to bring up what was going on. Um, so I just wanted to come over here and tell him, look, you know... I'm sorry for how I handle things, and you know, it, I just I, I I get your perspective. I apologize, and I want to make things good because at the podcast, I didn't have time to apologize for anything because JT and Jesse were here the whole time. They weren't. I don't want to. It's all a conversation to have in front of anybody, so I just figured I could get done with now, so we're good going forward. We had chilling and grilling this week. Yep, it's big time. All right. Um, did you uh, you know, did you, did you watch the video on the uh, the contract? No, I was there. Why would I need to watch it? You didn't go through and watch it at all? No, I didn't. He did the editing for them. I saw he put it up later. You should probably watch it. <laughs>